Good evening. I'm here uh, to show you another build uh, without lots of cargo. It's just yes, a, uh, for example, attack craft. Uh, this is a battleship inspired. This has nothing to do with what I'm going to show you guys. This is a battleship based on Stroud and Eklund, Eklund. Uh, but it's not my build I copied from YouTube. It's really cool, so I want to keep it. Uh, this one, I did the guide on this build in another video, so you can go and check it out. Uh, this one is also a Deimos, uh, battle, Deimos inspired battleship. I'm not kind of fond of it. I need to change some things. This was also based on a build I saw on YouTube. Um, <clears throat> I'm just missing now a Novogalactic battleship that um, kind of working on that with this one. Uh, but I need to tweak it a lot. It still has lots of famous parts. But yeah, I think in building it. This is my main hauler with putting 1000 cargo plus 2000 shielded. But as I said, this is not what I'm going to show you guys. Uh, I'm also taking the opportunity to showcase my own ships if you guys want a guide on one of these. Just let me know. This is my upgraded racing leaf. Um, and this is literally one of my favorite builds because it's compact. It has medium carb capacity, 2640, 8 crew, uh, and everything that you might want for medium game, so to speak. I'm going to show you guys. Uh, I tried to build it based on the Pelican, but from Halo, but with kind of a few changes. Um, first off, you do not need this amount of fuel. I'm just using it for aesthetic purposes. If you want to copy it for free, if you don't want any of this, whatever, it's your. To the point you start building, it's your build, and I am. Uh, nothing to do with it so let's go on the i'm gonna take the weapons off so on the right side we have we have this as you can see two layers of uh, halves and the first I have the commander bridge commander bridge which has 360 cargo as you can see in the bottom it's literally this amount of cargo that this ship has many of you as you also commented on other video the lack of cargo it's not your thing okay um as I said this uh, these first videos are from the attack, my supposed attack uh, craft, and then I will pass to the green one that I said that I prefer with it, which is compact that has 2000 cargo. Here you have the slender thrusters, I think they fit well, there are ones that fit better, but if you increase the weight you cannot use the other ones, you need to use these ones. So, you will need uh, two engine braces. This, this to make these assumption of wings and payload and so on. This is just like as if a smaller air intake for the engines and so on. And uh, yeah, let's go. I have this as follows. I have the captain quarters here that leads directly to the bridge. I have Dane's spines for a box. 
I have a workshop here because to me it comes in handy. But as I said, feel free to do whatever you want. You can even place cargo here instead of this one uh, because it's not occupying cruise stations or anything like that. Uh, yeah, you can use top ones as uh, cargo or change it up, bring the control stations up top, both, I use both because of the crew amount, because of those sweet boosts, and you can simply keep two halves and the and cargo on the bottom or something like that. The right side, I mean the left side, <laughs> it's pretty much the same, to be honest. It's a mirror build, so I do not like my, I don't like asymmetric builds because it gives me the OCD turbulences. I'll show you how I have the, I am gonna do this first. As you can see, this is how I have it. The grab drive is here. You can also choose a small one. This is one of the big ones. You can choose a smaller one and bring this all down. I will show you that after this. I'm just going to show you the first build, my main build, so to speak, and then I'll show you if you want to use something smaller. So, this is just for purposes. As you can see, the bay gives directly to the control station, the bottom, the bottom half. Base, it's up to you. The docker is here, and I have the graph drive and the reactor here. So, what I said that you can do if you want to do it, it's simply you can come here and do this. For example, this is a C class ship at the moment. It's gonna try and do a B class reactor. B class. You have this one here and a graph drive as well. B class. This one 36, 33, or yeah, this one will be the best. Okay. And then check this. You can do this. Bring it all down and make it even more compact and also you and as I said for example if you decide to maintain this high you can put some cargo here and here or simply drag this down insert another engine here but yeah 140 uh, top speed with 100 mobility I will need it if you want for example this for cargo, you can this and uh, funky. do this. And there you go. It's the same height. This kind of ugly as hell, but it's up to you. As I said, let's take up the cargo from here. Do this, and you can bring this one down. Let's change the shield as well for a B class. Top 15. This one is not that bad actually. And then you will need to have this. I'm going to show you. So this, this. This, this, this. And run into some problems that I'm currently not in first. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, this is the problem. You might yeah, use this option. You might need to not use this because of the engine, as you can see. Now you will see that the issue that I have is fixed. But it will look a bit wonky. But you can 
try to fix some other thing here too. So you can you know, that, something like that, as you can see. And yeah, of course, we have to change the colors. If you want to, for example, another tip, if you want to, for example, choose the same colors in this as you have in this, you come here, select that one and control, you also select that one, like that, you click to change the, the colors and the, the one you have predefined on the main, uh, that you have before, it's the one that's already, if you don't know what kind of color to pick, but yeah, there you go. Uh, you can do this as well. Just click enter. There you go. This one. There you go. You have here just ugly. You have to pull this forward and place cargo here if you want. It's not as ugly as before, but you can see. And um, yeah, for example, again, the example of the color black, red, and white. You can see it's not that bad actually. And this is now a P class ship. And with the same, you can do, and you can do the same with a A class, just simply change that. Um, but yeah, any kind, uh, any doubts you have, for, as I said, this is the C class, which is my ship. ship. It has little to no cargo because I prefer it like that uh, because I sometimes do role play when I'm kind of bored with life, not with the game. But I will show you side of the ship how it's like because I know that that's something that I missed in my previous video I really wanted to show you guys the inside ignore this name I have tried many times but I have no idea why it never let me just uh, whatever let's, let's try to I would be surprised if it, uh, yeah, it does not change. I don't know why this ship doesn't want to move. Welcome to my outpost, that's for another day. Yeah. So. I'm gonna show as well the bumblebee inside the ship. As you can see, it's kind of it has a kind of uh, underbite, but it bites, so... As you can see, it has... I used the fuel tanks as... bombs. Of course, they do not work, but yeah. This is where you have the docker, the bay, it's all here. Then you have the two Name bottom me for something, hubs. Boss. Two bottom hubs. Then you go up directly in the captain's quarters. There's the upgrade. Here is the workshop itself. Where's my blushes? Right, right. And here's the cup. Struts retracting. Let's get out of here. Stay in orbit or jump. And yeah, as you can see, you can actually have a real nice uh, output from this layout. This is the ship to fly. As you can see, 
me. Oh shit. This one. Okay, let's see the max speed. Let's see if I know that's something that the brightness would want. At this moment cruising to at max power 215 with boost. Taken. So let's land again. in another video. I think I'll do that if not it would be a clutter it would be really annoying. If you would, I mean it's it's literally the same to be honest the inside. It has two two stories but they are both uh, control stations so that I can keep the ship on the minimum scale possible with eight crew members so yeah it's not it's nothing extraordinary but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed and see you on reddit or youtube whatever let me know if you want to see other guides or if you want me to build something specific i'll try my best have fun see you